Hey guys, welcome back to Salty News Network. It's Summer here and today we're going to be showing you Sonic Gear's latest series of true wireless earphones. We have the full lineup of the TWS ear pumps from 1 all the way to 7 in our hands, but today we're going to be focusing on the newer lineup, which is the 3 Plus, 5 Pro and 7 Hyper Bass. If you want to know more about the TWS 1 and 2, feel free to check out the written reviews that we've done before. Links are in the description box. Without further ado, let's get started. First up, looking at the 3 Plus. If you're someone who prefers something more colorful in your hands, these come in four colors. White, black, red, and blue. The TWS 5 Pro and 7 Hyper Bass on the other hand, only comes in black and white. Now, let's unbox them and see what's inside. Opening up the TWS 3 Plus, you will see the casing and the earphones laid out. The casing feels quite light and has a glossy finish. It also comes with a micro USB charging cable for the casing. It's the common conventional earphone design, which looks suspiciously similar to a certain fruit we know. The earphones fall right into place in the casing since it's magnetic. The casing lid is also magnetic, and you might find some resistance in this one in particular when lifting the lid. But hey, that's how you know your earphones are safe. Next is the TWS 5 Pro. The TWS 5 Pro has a somewhat flat cylindrical casing, and it's slightly bigger than the 3 Plus. It also comes with a micro USB charging cable and your standard large, medium and small ear tips. The lid has a very nice click when opening and closing. The casing has a much nicer touch to it and a very nice matte finish. Last is the TWS 7 Hyper Bass. The casing is much larger compared to the two earlier and it also has the nice matte finish like the 5 Pro. The shape looks like earplugs and it gives a tight fit since it's an in-ear. Unlike the conventional earphone design on the 3 Plus, which rests comfortably outside the ear. All of the earphones have Bluetooth 5.0 and can easily be paired to your phone. Just turn them on in a casing, select the earphones, and you're done. The 3 Plus has a round tip and slides into your ears nicely. If you prefer a tighter fit, the 5 Pro and the 7 Hyper Bass comes with a variety of ear tips, so that you can find the right fit. It's important for you to find the right fit because you're going to want it to stay in your ears and get the most out of the passive noise cancelling. These fit pretty well into your ears once you find the correct fit between the ear tips. If you're clumsy and poke guy, this would still probably stay in. Your shoe might come off though, but these would definitely still be in your ears. You get 3 full charges from the casing for each of these earphones. The 3 Plus advertises up to 6 hours of playtime, while the 5 Pro and the 7 Hyper Bass advertises up to 8 hours of playtime. It takes about an hour to fully charge a pair of buds and 2 hours to charge the casing from zero. So for 10 minutes of charging time from the casing, you're getting about an hour of playtime on the 3 Plus and an hour and 20 minutes on the 5 Pro and 7 Hyper Bass. The 5 Pro has an IPX5 rating, which means it is water resistant and can take a low pressure water spray. The 7 Hyper Bass on the other hand has an IPX4 rating which is splash proof. Both of them are perfect for cramming at the gym and sweating buckets without having to worry that you'll drown. Functionality-wise, these earphones do not have buttons nor user swiping gestures, but are completely controlled by touch commands instead. Such as the usual double tap to increase or decrease volume, triple tap to switch to the previous or next song, and so on. It also enables your voice assistant when you touch the earphones for 3 seconds, which is super handy on the go. We've also done a simple mic test for three of these earphones just to see what you sound like when taking a call on these. We're testing this by the pool where there's a lot of ambient noises from the water and from the wind. But now that we're testing this indoors, it definitely sounds better. These buds are also great for taking long calls and meetings on the go because of its long-lasting battery life. And as mentioned earlier, the passive noise cancelling on these things are pretty okay. Popping them on, everything around me is lowered to a decent volume. On top of whatever EDM you're vibing to at the gym, it will definitely drown out all the weird grunting noises from your gym buddies but just enough to hear if someone flies off a treadmill. Now, we're going to dive into the performance of these earphones. The bass on the TWS 3 Plus is okay and the audio is decent. It's a very good value for money at only 129 ringgit for a pair of true wireless earphones. It also has more colours to choose from to better match your style. If you have a bit more budget to work with, you can take a look at this one, the TWS 5 Pro. The audio is nice and clear on this one, and it also has a decent amount of bass. 
The T-Level S7 Hyper Base is one of my personal favorites, if you have even more budget to spare. It looks super cool and the audio is super clear. It has dual drivers, which means it has two separate speakers to handle audio, one for high and mid frequencies and the other one for bass. This creates a richer and fuller sound, which makes any kind of music sound better. The bass, on the other hand, isn't as intense as the 5 Pro. If you're the type of person who prefers a more balanced sound, this would be the perfect fit for you. All three of these earphones support a wireless distance up to 10 meters. So if you're vibing to some music while taking out the trash, it will still be connected. Conclusion time! Now these are great for everyday casual consumers. It's nice and compact if you just want something to throw into your bag and just head out. Amongst all of these earphones, the best variety has to go to the TWS 3 Plus because of its pretty nice colors and it's a super good value buy. For all of your Dongzi Dongzi needs, the TWS 5 Pro has the best base for all of the hit banging uppings and aliens. That leaves the TWS 7 Hyper Bass with the best style with a simple and elegant design. Of course, the best part is, is the balanced sound stage that you get for your music. And no, we haven't forgotten about the TWS 1 and 2. Comparing between these, the new ones definitely gotten themselves some cool upgrades in performance. As mentioned earlier, we've done a written review on these, so make sure you check them out in the description box. The earphones are also priced decently from 99 ringgit to 199 ringgit. If you want them, you can head to the link included in the description box. That's all for me today and thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, make sure you give us a thumbs up and share this out to your friends. As always, if you have some salt to pour, I'll see you guys in the comments. Till next time, bye!